All right, welcome back to Guillotine Gaming. This is Sam and... I'm Tyler. And we're continuing our playthrough of Mario 3D Land. Uh, Don't but... correct me. <laughs> well, <I'll... laughs> This oh. is the Game Boy game. <laughs> Black and white. We actually used the patch to colorize it. 3D Land was in color and was on the 3DS. What are you talking about? Oh. oh I was... No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Never mind, my whole charade was just blown out of the water. So I get to play this level. So you just get I to meant Mario Land. <laughs> Three. D. <laughs> oh, this is Toad's Treasure Trackers, right? This is like the beta for it. You could I guess you could look at it like that. Yeah. I just really dude, I could play like a hundred levels of this. Like I love how like Toad like the the captain, Captain Toad here, is like go like in the treasure trackers. He like goes through hell just to get like little power ups and yeah. like things. And then like when you see him in this game, it's like he's already gone through all this shit. You're not even aware of. And when he gives you like the simplest mushroom to help you out, like you you don't even realize how hard it was for him. Like he ri he literally risked life and limb. I don't know how many limbs, but what two arms. Two legs, mushroom head. <laughs> mushroom head. You think he listens to that shit even? <laughs> <laughs> he might be a fan of mushroom head. I'm not sure. We should ask, like, should Gary me and Yeah, or personally, like, is Toad a fan of the band Mushroom Head? He'll just be like, What the fuck are you talking <laughs> about? <laughs> like, oh, listen, I've I've come up with some interesting tea upending ideas in my day, but what are you talking about? <laughs> I just want to point out this is blow, so what am I supposed to like... You're literally supposed to put your skills to practice. <laughs> Everything you've learned about blowing, you... You just let it go. <laughs> uh, and he's so happy. Do you think if... You, if like, it's such people, a good feel game. If people who haven't played these levels in 3D World, do you think they're not going to have any idea how to play? No, not really. Is it's, there like a story? It's, it's so like simple. I'm sure there'll be some sort of story, very minimalistic. Or maybe they'll use Toad's Treasure Tracker to be like their in-depth, like, narrative game. They're like, <laughs> it's their open world game the, we've been yeah, trying for. The open, like, it's like the most epic, like, more, more di like, voice acting. You'll have full cinematic experience. It'll be like Guardians of the Galaxy, but it'll be Toad. And or like, um... Toad in the Galaxy. Captain Toad. Toad would like, he thought the voice acting in this game was awesome. You have no idea <laughs> until when you see Toad talk. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Hello! Like, clear, like, he's like the kind of guy you would never like want to make fun of, but you're like. Like, you don't know if like he's gone through shit. Yeah, you're just like, oh, you're just like a good, you're just good to him. Can you like, please help? <laughs> I was trying to see if there was a hidden thing in the jig. Alright, so this game, like, clearly is introducing, like, Mario Strikers elements. Have you ever played that? It's like oh, the... Oh, the soccer one? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no. This is for, like, what, the GameCube? Yeah, I think they brought it over the Wii as well. Oh, yeah, probably. Like, a port of it. I say it with confidence. I think it was Mario Strikers Charged, or something like that. Yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> damn it, damn it! Go! What are you doing? What? I got it. <laughs> I shot for the stars. All right, so we can continue on with our life, but don't get hit by the thwomp. We can. We don't even have. We could just do this. But if you really want, we can get those uh, the clocks to save all the time that we're not wasting. Damn it! Should I go back to where you are? Uh, yeah, just a little bit, just so we can get this. One, two, three, thirty seconds that we probably didn't even need. I don't think it's gonna yeah. take. What's this like? Ten minutes? Ah! <laughs> just bust right through the defense. That's what she said. Anyways, look at me, look at them. Look at that derpy ass face as they come towards us. Ow. Like that is not the look of determination. That's no no no. This one. 
I can't climb over there like you. Oh! Okay. <laughs> I can actually I can, I have there we go. I have a cat. Like, I have a cat in my pocket and I'm ready to let it loose. This was the HD Mario game like I was waiting for. When when you saw this, like the trailers and stuff and you're just like, what the hell? I was blown away. It's it's so like so much better than uh New Super Mario Bros. U. Yeah, uh, yeah, Mario Bros. U is is like an over glamorized turd. I mean it's a good game, but like it's it definitely looks, a good it looks, it's it looks a, like the Wii, the Wii one. But yeah, like slightly. just HD. And it's solid. It's just like, okay, let's just put out a game for and a Mario Dude, game at that. You know it didn't take long to make. No, exactly. Where, where this, and that, you could totally tell. Oh, they, they put everything into this. They got, like, live band playing. They got, like, all all the, the graphics, the level oh. design, the co-op involved, the artwork. They have it all. They really gave a shit, basically. Yeah, and plus... And it's not to say new... No, it's not. It's, it's just not like, a it was bad very, title. It's just you clearly it was very know. Safe. It's yeah, safe. it's oh yeah. You could tell it was like bare bones. Even though you know it's it's a full game. It's just not this. And even this, like I I still am like waiting for like like a galaxy kind of yeah, like a more like not level by level like Mario Land formula, more like. Sunshine or 64, Galaxy, even. See, I wasn't that crazy about uh, Sunshine. I always, like, well, you know, I grew up with it, but I always loved that game. And I enjoyed, even today, if you if we played it, it's fucking hard. You will, it's not an easy game. No, dude, like, I think I got, It will like, piss you off. <laughs> yeah, that's just what we want. <laughs> that's true. Actually, I, I am most satisfied by games that, like, where they actually challenge you in some way. I would, in some way being intentionally or, or just being well, fucking annoying. There's some things <laughs> that, like, some of, like, especially in some of the survival horror games, especially the first Silent Hill, they give you, like, you have to, like, put a tennis ball down a pipe and, like... <laughs> the most vague You shit. have to know, like, what was the, like, the, one of the piano ones? Like, you had to figure out, like, the, a crow, like, you had to know types of birds. <laughs> And their correlation to a piano, and like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> yeah, there's like no like solid way for you to like figure, but somehow you do it. Like, someone figured it out without looking it up. I mean, it, whenever it came out, I'm not sure, but it's... I would have gave up. I <laughs> like, uh, <laughs> I don't know. That's like the first thing like you have to do once you finally get to one of the buildings. Resident Evil at least was a little more. Yeah, just it's push, it like, had puzzles and stuff. It was kind of like in like Zelda, you just push something here. Yeah, something shiny. Or you, yeah, or you find a shiny object and it tells you like this is a shiny object. You, it's it has a keyhole shape of you know like a dragon's crest or you know some weird yeah description that lets you know like when you find the keyhole, it's like I am the dragon's keyhole, and it's like all right, I can insert yeah. you in here. I like with with the Mario games at least. It's just genuine fun. Like, it's pure fun can... condensed in a in a game. It's definitely. <laughs> Look at me! I was like shimming up the stairs there. Like, I couldn't. That's you not got... what he wanted to do with his life. He was forced like, into that. We gotta go in the sewer system. And this is exactly I like the transparent doing. pipes. That's like what they're big. Like, oh, this is uh, HD next generation. Uh, we have transparent pipes now with the power of the Wii U. <laughs> can render pipes. Yeah, we still have 8-bit Mario running around as, on screen. Obviously an art style choice, but still. <laughs> Conk Door Canyon. I love the names. These are, oh, I assume yeah, these guys I, are conk doors because they conk right on your head and they're condors. Like, very clever. Very ugly, very unattractive birds. Condors? Yeah. I'm a, <laughs> I'm a condor and I'm gonna smash your head in. <laughs> Get close. I'll be your friend. <laughs> and he's, the thing is, is he doesn't wait. He doesn't try to like butter you up. He just goes for the kill. So you're like immediately wary. Yeah, like you immediately distrust him. He doesn't even like say like, oh hi there, buddy, and like lure you in. He's just like, no. <laughs> he's like, <laughs> I like this is uh. The music from Mario 2. Oh, holy Santa! Oh my god. You could still make it. 
Oh. Uh, <laughs> no! No! <laughs> you dragged me down. <laughs> Don't blame me, son. I'm not. I'm just saying. I didn't want to. I didn't want to live in this world without you. I was like, you know what? Forget it. Why? Why? We're not even saving Peach. Forget it. Why? I only went on long because you. Don't we want that? Yeah. Oh look at you! You think you're so good. <laughs> I was walking on the wall over there. I'll slick. Like a Smash Mouth song. <laughs> Guys. No! <laughs> he fucking... The cat suit is so cool. That's I'll go so down there. So much more useful. Yeah. Like you could like you have the pounce, you have the jump and pounce. So for this, we're just gonna like jump back and forth. No, nothing fancy here. We just want. Don't get greedy. <laughs> <laughs> we just want our gold. <laughs> I love gold! <laughs> Do you think bees would be in the desert? Is that... Is that... I don't think they could survive in the desert. Don't they need, uh... honey? And flowers? <laughs> they, I think they, they need flowers. <laughs> they need flowers to pollinate. You have to kill this... Bird. It just reminds me of Conker's Bad Fur Day. With the... Do you, do you know what I'm talking about? Where like you have to like pollinate a flower or get a bee. no, you have to get the bee to pollinate the flower. And of course they're like you know everyone has personality like and little googly eyes and shit. <laughs> 